your sights. It is your boy, the Nitro General, here back at it again for a brand new episode of our Pokemon Insurgents playthrough. If you guys are excited for this and you want to show some support, make sure you let me know by hitting that like button down below and subscribe if you guys are new. Help me hit my end of the year goal of 350 subscribers. But, uh, yeah, guys, let all that out of the way. Let's get right into it. So, in the last episode, we, uh, finally defeated, we defeated our first Mega Pokemon. Uh, we got the Mega Stone for Delta Charizard, which we're gonna check out in this episode. The team's relatively the same. Uh, we, we still got Whiffs, Chomper, Zingy, Buggy, Icy Boy, and Burp here. So, um, yeah. I mean, we're just gonna continue. I did heal him up. I did go all the way back to Helio City to heal him up. I also bought some revives and potions to use the rest of the money that we had to do that, so... Um, but I'm really, really excited. Can I battle you? Yes. Okay. Let's Mega Evolve our Delta Charizard, guys. Unless he has, like, a nice type or something. A Butterfree, that's fine. Okay, here we go. Here we go, guys. I've never seen this before. Okay. Mega? Oh, my God. I'm so excited! What is this thing? I've never seen this. I've never seen this. Yo! <laughs> Darken the sky? Okay. How did you withstand that? <laughs> Yo! Dude, that thing is epic! Yo, that thing is so cool! But send in Noctowl. Go ahead, send out Joe Noctowl, bro. Man, I need defaults on this thing so bad. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, that doesn't do anything. And that does more than I wanted it to. So as much as I don't want to, I think we gotta I want you to see this thing so Oh my god, it's this sprite is so dope! That's so cool. I cannot wait till we battle Damien again so we can see that blast look. Oh my god, that's so cool. Yeah, we four times resist that, my guy. And I'm just gonna hit you with an ice beam, and you should just go down here. Good bub, bubba. Oh, bubba. Wow. This guy breaking again. Alright, I'm setting a crowbat. I mean, we have. I have Icy Boy that can deal with crowbat. Rather than, you know, try to, uh, stay in with, uh, Zingy here. Losing the PP on probably one of the Pokemon that we need more than anything right now. Let's hit you with an ice cold crash. You have an acrobatics. This is gonna kill. Alright. I was like, I was like, it could have a flying type move, but we should be okay. Not with acrobatics. Not with 120 base power attack without. You know, we're just gonna hit you with base power, so. Get out of here. Get out of here, you stupid. Oh my god, how? How? Dude. How is that even possible? And you're Proba, you're not bulky. You are one of the most frail Pokemon ever. You might be one of my top five favorite Pokemon of all time. But you're you're weak. Your your defenses are weak. And you withstood a an ancient power from a defeatist. God, dude. Defeatist burp. You wish to that, bro. Oh my god. This. This is a little. It's a little absurd, not gonna lie. Uh, after, even after the first battle, this makes me want to skip these trainers. Like, if I don't have to battle them, let's just go <clears throat> and help the auger here, because that's what we need to do. Okay. Oh my, are you kidding me? Nah, you're kidding me, bro. You are kidding me. <clears throat> Alright, what's up, Damien? Alright, Nitro G, are you ready? We need to warn the auger that the Sky Cult is on the way up. Otherwise, it might blackmail him into summoning Rayquaza. I bet you he's gonna be part of a call or something. I don't think he's a good... I don't think he's a good guy, the auger. Yes, sir. Everything is ready upstairs. We can... Whoa, whoa, whoa! Isn't this a sight for sore eyes? Is that Damien and Nitro G from Telenor Town? The 
It's good to see you two again, but I must ask, why are you here? Was it too late to challenge our gym? If it was, you're in luck. East here is our very own Sky-themed gym leader. He excels in both dragon and flying types. No, sir, we're here because because we have heard members of Sky Talk called talking. They want to they want to summon Rayquaza and they plan to blackmail you them into helping. What? Blackmail you into helping them? That is a serious problem. You're positive about this? Are you sure? You heard what they said correctly? If so, then this sure certainly is a problem. Out of all this time to come, of course they do. I hope this wouldn't have to happen, but what's done is done. Come on out of Ah, uh -huh, he is. He's the leader of the Sky Call. I knew it. I knew it. Uh, uh, what's going on? Sorry about this, Steve. I truly am. You were so useful and bright. It can't be helpful. You heard what my call just said, and I can't leave you with a chance. You might connect with us. Your cultist? What do you mean? I knew it. I knew it. I am the leader of the sky. Surprise? You shouldn't be. When you think about it, it's pretty obvious. I created the sky call several years ago, just before the auger disappeared. We were a small group at first, a ragtag band who were unit united by the desire for one thing, change. You see, the auger was the perfect hero of the people, along with his partner, Hoopa. He defeated cult after cult, trying to bring good values to the people of the Torah, such as peace, love, Peace and love and mercy. <clears throat> Being merciful, he, for he forgave anyone who begged him to, letting criminals go unpunished. As a result, there were members of the disbanded cults joined other ones, making it a completely. I did not read that last part. I accidentally hit the A button. Yogger was strong, but he was a coward. He wasn't able to do what was necessary to keep the reason safe. So I dealt with it and crowned myself his successor. With the new Augur, we can cure the disease plaguing to our good. We can save the region forever. You'll never get away with this, monster! Oh, but Davy, I already have. With the print of propaganda, I've already got all the Torian on my side. That's why I can't let you two blab about my true identity. Realistically, nobody will. But it's a risk I can't take. It's a risk I am not willing to take. Uh, <clears throat> I want to capture it. With his incredible strength and control of the sky, I can be om omnipresent, omniscient, and omnipotent. I create a utopia, free of war and crime. I refuse to be the coward that the first augur was. Any criminal, any threat to a perfect world needs to be removed. I found the sky cult out in the east. And now, we've accumulated all we need to summon Rayquaza. The sacrifice can begin. Rayquaza will be summoned, and it will be mine. The soon to be peaceful world. Peaceful region will thrive under my command. East, get one of the cultists. It's time to start. Sir, I know we plan to sacrifice one of them, but since these kids are here and are gonna send their lives in prison anyways, why not sacrifice one of them? We wouldn't need to waste any cultists. That's not a terrible idea, East. And after what Nitro G's done to me, I'll enjoy every second of it. What? Nitro G is what Nitro G has done to you? Oh, he won't remember. He's forgotten nearly everything. But he tried to save your life. We came to warn you about Sky Calls. Fair point. I would be hypocritical to sacrifice you after taking you out of Utopia, wouldn't it? Let your G, in the spirit of fairness, I will give you a fighting chance. You battle with East, and the loser gets forfeit to use the ritual. But, sir, why are you risking me? Why not use one of our grunts? Because you are a gym leader, and I'm sure you will win. Let your G doesn't stand a chance. But, East, are you questioning me? No, sir. Sorry about this, Nitro G. It's nothing personal, but the Augur's orders were given. Okay. So hear me out. We have an amazing team for a flying and dragon type gym. And he leads off with Skarmory. Do I want to just... Because I, I feel like he's just going to set up... I think we just Shadow Ball, because I think he's going to try to set up... I mean, if he's... If he's, uh, he's leading with Skarmory, then chances are he's trying to set up Spikes or... Uh, um, stealth Rocks, is what I'm guessing. Uh, so, this should do a lot. Yeah, oh, it hung on with Sturdy. Spikes, I told you. I told you guys. 
I figured that's what it would do, because that's what Skarmory always does, and since this game has a, well, at least we know that we can Oko it now. So we don't have to worry about getting up another move. So now we can just Shadow Ball again, and we should we'll be able to take this thing out. So the first member is gone. That's really, really, really big. Um, so, sending Kingdra. Okay, this could get a little sketchy here. I almost want to go into Chompers and try Ice Fanging. The thing is, is that I don't know what... I don't know what Wisp... Okay, let, let, me, let, me, just, let me just check this out. So, Kendra has, has a high speed. Right, okay, so it's 85. There is a chance that we could Oko with Wisp, especially with uh, Dragon. Uh, with uh, Dragon Breath. We might be able to outspeed it. I don't know for sure. But also, if we can lead with Chompers, right, and get him to do two Draco Meteors, that's going to lower special attack by two. Now we should be able to come in. And I should be I could just come in. I might... Now, I could just not risk it. And just come in with Zingy here. Um, I actually might do that. And try Ice Beaming. Or I guess we could try Shock Waving. Focus Energy. Oh, no. How much is Shock Wave doing? Not enough. What about Ice Beam? Hydro Pump. Oh, Zingy. No. Oh, no. Yo, that's really, 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 really bad. Losing Zingy is huge. I might have to use a revive on that thing. Can, can we outspeed? Can we outspeed this? Can we outspeed this? Can we outspeed? We outspeed! Let's go! Let's go, Wisp. That's huge. Uh, Dragon Pulse! Let's get it! Finally, we have such a better move. Then Dragon Breath. Yes. Okay. About to the sky is dark. Please about to send in Noivern. This this would be perfect for. Okay. So here, what I kind of want to do is I kind of think I'm gonna go Icy Boy, and I think we have to revive Zingy. I think we have to revive Zingy because the thing is that you Pokemon like this, we can't. Noivern has a high speed stat too, and I don't want it to. Okay, so let's let's use a revive on Zingy. Now Zingy's not that fast. So if I could hyper potion him up too, that would be phenomenal. But I don't know if I can. Air slash, that's gonna go. It didn't, it didn't, it didn't go. Okay. Okay, so. Alright, let's heal up Zingy here. <clears throat> okay. Yes, he's all fresh now. He's got a flamethrower. Having flamethrower. Okay, that's 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 really not good. Not for Ziggy. Okay. Um. <clears throat> I don't know if Ziggy could take a flamethrower. It's not stab. <clears throat> but I have to. I have to rely on the fact that Ziggy can take a flamethrower, man. From a not stab Noivern or somehow outspeed. Oh, come on, come on, Zingy. Come on, Zingy. Yes! Let's go. Oh, focus, Sash. Okay, we, we should be okay because I can just already shard it. Okay, it doesn't have another potion, doesn't have another full restore. That thing's gone. That's big. Um, I'm going to send in Altaria. I think we stay in. Does Altaria have Flamethrower though too? Or Fire Blast? Oh my god, don't be Mega Altaria. Please don't be Mega Altaria. We gotta heal up. If this is Mega Altaria, man, I don't know what we do. I mean, I could come in with Burb, I guess. No, it is Mega Altaria! No! Yo, no. And it takes away its Dragon typing though. Right? So it's no longer Dragon, it's Flying Fairy. It's got Fire Blast. And we we hung on. I don't think I outspeed. I think I just have to go for a nice shard for Chip. He could miss it. He missed it. 
I think I just gotta keep going for Ice Shard here. I, I can't risk going for an Ice Beam. Okay, so there's Hyper Voice. Does it get that? Does it get that move that makes it Fairy type? Move? Okay, so I think I don't think we go into Wisp. I think we gotta go into Burb. We can't go into Wisp. Um, I think I have the Ancient Power. How much is this? Shit, it's no longer gonna be resisted. Cotton Guard. Defense rose drastically. Okay, Ancient Power once more. Hyper Voice. Yeah, we're in defeatist, so I have to just go for an Ancient Power. I was gonna try to go for Quick Attack, but it doesn't really matter. We get the boosts, so there's that. Um, <clears throat> but. Uh, which is kind of cool. About to say, Talonflame. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. If I heal up Burb, because of our boosts, Talonflame can't touch us. I don't know what his last mod is, but if, as long as it's not like a dragon typing, or it's a slow dragon, we win. Source Dance. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. But this is going to be four times effective. It's going to be four times effective. It should just all go. No Focus Sash. We're good. Even if it did, we get a quick attack. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it, bro. About to send a Glide Score. We're good. We won. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, dude. I'm just gonna use your power again, but it doesn't really matter. We have our Mega Charizard in the back, and we're good, right? Oh, damn it. All right, well, let's go for an Acrobatics then. This should be doing a lot. Didn't, oh, we got the flinch, because, yeah, we got the flinch because of the, the King's Rock. It doesn't matter. You don't have enough. You don't have enough. You don't have enough. You don't have enough. Let's get it. Let's get it, dude. You're the one being sacrificed, my guy. You're the one being murdered while I stay here alive. Let's get it. Man, I am very proud of myself for how I played that gym battle. I am on the top of my game, guys. I, I lost? I don't believe it. Disappointed, East. I love to change my mind to save you, but I can't. I made a promise. A strong ruler keeps his promises. I'm sorry. Farewell. What happened to that dude? He is like turning into a megastone? In my mind's eye, I see a ridge filled with blood. It is far off, almost on cheap country. Death on the way to that goal is a triviality. Each sacrifice was not in vain, especially now that I can use him to summon my father. You can follow me up to the roof if you want. Try and stop me, I dare you, but be warned, I'm not going to spare you twice. Alright guys, so we have to go, we have to heal here. Okay, <clears throat> so this this is this this is it. This is the the takedown with the auger here, guys. I am very very nervous about this battle. The fact that we won both of these last couple of battles on our first try, these really tough battles, is really saying something. But it's a beautiful crystal, isn't it? I don't know where it came from. It's been in possession of the first one. As long as I get it back. Even after a year of research and expert experimentation. I'm still in a close to finding out. On another hand, though, I've learned some very interesting things about what this crystal's capable of. Any kind of magic-based action, such as a spell or Pokemon attack, requires two things. A focus and energy. The energy is a power source for the attacker's spell, and the focus is what directs it into something. To do something. For example, a fire-type Pokemon may be able to blow a fire out of it. However, if they run out of PP power... If we have <laughs> PP power... <laughs> PP power. However, if they run out of PP, power points, they can. In this case, the focus would be the Pokemon usually moved, and the PP is the measure of energy left. Make sense? As near as I can tell, this crystal is a limitless source of energy. It contains the power of a thousand zones, maybe more. This, with this incredible power, the first auger was able to protect the region and defeat Call of the Call. Everyone said his Pokemon were incredibly strong because it's because they had the energy to use, well, incredible attack. Doubt's my turn. Put this, put this great gift on. I should use the soul of my servant each to summon the mightiest of beasts. Come forth, Rayquaza, herald of the skies. You will be my focus. I will use your abilities to harness my limitless energies. Uh, 
Oh my god, it's Rayquaza! Damn, man! Are you, are you gonna appear, Rayquaza? There we go, there he is! There's the Rayquaza! Definitely one of the coolest legendaries, I do have to say. I love Rayquaza. Oh, that's a dope sprite. At last, Rayquaza. Fight! We stand united. Together, the world can be ours. You will be my focus. You will harness my limitless energy, and under our leadership, we will create a utopia. There will be no crime or hatred, no war or revolution. Only a perfect, peaceful society, and I will be its king. And for you, Nigeria, I should have dealt with you and tell her time while I had the chance. You are more of a threat to me than you will ever be under the realize. If I let you go, who knows what you might do? Who knows what kind of trouble you will stir up? There's no room for my in my perfect world and the insert too close to me. If you stand in my way, I will squash you like a gnat. Prepare yourself. Rayquaza, show him no mercy. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. This place Oh, he's literally just got Rayquaza. And he's only level 50. I just mega evolve. I just mega evolve in in, in uh, Dragon Balls. It does it doesn't even matter at this point. Um, oh well, that thing. I think it's probably gonna outspeed us now. It doesn't matter though. Zingy is just gonna be able to. I think gonna be able to take this thing out. Um, that's a dope design. That's a dope uh, sprite for Mega Rayquaza. So I like this music though, man. All we have to do is withstand one attack and we win anyways. Oh man, so defense spell, special defense. Damn it. Okay, um... I have, I have to go into Zingy here. Um... And we just Ice Beam. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let, let's take one. Yes, we win. There's, there's no way. There's no way this thing. With the, with the special, two special defense drops, there's no way this thing takes an ice beam from me. From me. There's no way. See, yeah, it's done. You're done. You're done. You're done. Get out of here, man. Get out of here. I can't believe it. The power of the crystal failed me. You annoying brat, you were lu just lucky. I won't make the same mistake twice. Rayquaza, draw upon the power of the crystal to hear yourself. Bring yourself back to full strength and we'll resume attack. Use Icy Wind now! That's not what I'm very much. Hey, Nitro G, I just dropped some ice around. Here. You see where it landed? I'd say it's sorry, but I'm really not. It's a good thing Rayquaza's weak to ice, huh? That one was for, for your lies to torn region. And this one is for trying to kill my friend. Oh, look at that! Shaman blew up the stone! What? No! The crystal! You fool! Do you realize what you've done? You broke it! A limitless source of energy! Now it pieces all over the region! You stupid, stupid, stupid child! Rayquaza, quick! Those pieces need to be found before they fall into the wrong hands! Damien, Nitro G, you have made a powerful enemy today. I will see to it that you both feel the string, the sting, <laughs> the sting of my wrath. Bye. I can't believe he was a traitor all along. I used to look up to him. He's my hero. But I guess all that was propaganda, huh? The worst part is, is that we can't tell anyone about this. Nobody would believe us. I know I wouldn't. You know what we need to do? We need to fight off those cultures ourselves. Because the auger clearly isn't doing it for us. We're strong. We have legendaries on our side. After all, I think we can pull it off. Plus, there's a prophecy that Nora was talking about. I nearly forgot. I found these on the ground where you and East battled. I figured you should have them. They're yours after all. Pin summon patch. Oh, an aerial is. Cool. Let you put the TM41 down. Found East. Obtained East Well. Let you put East Well. I'll meet you in Alter Town. There's an old library there. Maybe we can learn more about the prophecy. Now, where was heading there? I'll see you there in the future. Man, a lot has happened in this episode, guys. A lot. A lot, a lot. Oh, there's a cutscene here. I think this is one of the shards of the crystal. Go 
and feel the power emanating from it. This is about a th this is about a third. Let's hurry up the plaza. We need to find the rest before they fall into the wrong hands. How did I get into a cave? I wonder what this is. I'm sure Audrey, the leader of, of the Abyssal Cult, will re reward me greatly if I show this to her. Where'd the other one go? Is this the... I see. This is what I think it is. I'll make good use of this. Isn't that the dude from... I think that's the dude from that one house that we went into. But! I know this is a little, a little early, but I do think we're going to end off this episode here, guys. A lot has happened in this episode, and I don't want to jam-pack anything else. This seems like a great place to end it off. So we're going to end it off a little bit early. If you guys did enjoy this, make sure you hit that like button down below. Make sure you guys tune in for the next episode, because shit's about to go down. But that, guys, that is it for me. So like I say at the end of every video, I am the Nitro General. I really hope you guys did enjoy it, and I'll see you in the next one. Nitro General's out. Peace.